listening to the Eagles? No. Listening to the Eagles with the Morris Knowles Eagle? Surprising. What's not surprising? Watching News from the Nest at 9 a.m. every day. Good morning, Morris Knowles. Welcome to News from the Nest. I'm John Valerian. And I'm Andrew Tell. Today is Monday, November 21st, and here are your morning announcements. Attention freshmen, Gertrude Hawk chocolate orders and money are due to Mrs. Rock in guidance by the end of the day. Please keep the catalog and pink copy of the order form for your records and return everything else in your envelope to Mrs. Rock. The lip sync and rap battle auditions are today in room B34. The performance will be December 9th. Bring your music and your attitude and help make this a great show. The Stagecraft Club will have an important work session today. They need as many hands as possible, so please plan to be there. The Bible Club is collecting shaving cream and other toiletries for the homeless who are currently looking for jobs and preparing for interviews. Please leave any donations in the box in B51. Attention all DECA members. You can take a sample online regional test in your respective category after school today and tomorrow in B49. Regional testing will take place on November 29th and 30th. Please see Classroom for further details or Ms. Benack with any questions. And speaking of DECA, dine and donate is at Cafe Mozart tomorrow. A portion of your bill will be donated to DECA, and part of the proceeds will go to their state community service project, New Eyes for the Needy. Please pick up a flyer outside of B49 if you are interested. Boys basketball tryouts begin today. Upperclassmen are from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m., and freshmen follow from 7.30 to 9 p.m. And today's SAT word of the day is contrite, which is an adjective that means thoroughly sorry. Thanksgiving is a time to reflect on things for which we are thankful, but many people also take this contemplative time to be contrite and say they are sorry for some of the things they have said or done. The battle for powder puff bragging rights is Wednesday. Junior girls versus senior girls. The seniors come in as favorites, but the word on the street is the juniors are working quite hard and think the upset is a definite possibility. Isn't that an oxymoron? The snack stand will be open with all proceeds going towards Toys for Tots. The game begins at 1 o'clock down at Caruso. And now it's time for another segment of Coffee on the Couch. Ouch. With the great success of the fall play this weekend, we are fortunate to have the student directors of the play with us. So let's go over, over to the couch to hear more. here with the student director of the fall play rehearsal for murder, Zach Torgos. Can you tell us what the play was about? The play is a murder mystery about a man named Alex Dennison and his fiancée Monica Wells. They are both actors in the 50s and Monica all of a sudden dies. Alex sets out to find the murderer of the staged suicide through making a play about finding the murderer with his actor friends to set up and get the real murderer. Based on the audience's facial expressions and remarks, do you think people were surprised at how the play ended? Yes, people were very surprised. Everyone had different opinions on who committed the crime, and only two people out of many I talked to were actually correct with the whole time. Well, I know I was most definitely surprised and absolutely loved it. What are some comments people made after seeing this amazing production? They loved it. People said it was very interesting, very mysterious, and fun to watch. Did you enjoy being student director? What was it like being off the stage instead of on the stage? I really did enjoy it. It was a wonderful opportunity. Not only did I get to have the experience of directing alongside the wonderful Miss Mazer, I got to learn more about myself as a performer by being involved in the new perspective of directing and helping others grow as performers. Is there anything you'd like to say on behalf of the cast? They are all really happy and glad that everyone loved the show and on behalf of the cast we would like to thank everyone who came to see the show and supported it. We all worked really hard and it definitely paid off. Yes, it most definitely did. Thank you so much for being here on the Coffee on the Couch with me. I'm Molly O'Donnell. And I'm Zach Tarkos. Now back to you on the desk. Thank you, Molly and Zach. Great job with the play this weekend. And on that note, that's all for today, MK. Tune in tomorrow for another edition of News from the Nest. I'm John Valerian. And I'm Andrew Tell. Don't forget, Golden Eagles, the bird is the word. Have, Have a, a great, great day, day, MK. MK. It was a buffalo America Stolen from my
Africa, brought to America, fighting an arrival.